So that's my drivers. My main driver is probably my force. Not probably, it definitely is my force. All right, Patrick Blazik, uh, PJ for force, just craft. I got four of them in my bag. Wham. We got really stable. Um, I don't know if it's the colors. Discraft seems to have a lot of consistency with their colors. Pink ones, all of them are really stable. I use these for a lot of headwind, um, or if I just want a long hyzer shot. And then this is my bombing driver, my green force. It's really straight and it just glides and goes forever. Um, so yeah, force as a whole is just really consistent and you get a lot of distance out of them. Um, next would be, I like the surges. Got two of them in my bag. They're these are a very um, long flying disc. They glide forever. They're not as stable as a force. They're not near as stable as a force, but I like these for long wooded holes, um, like really long wooded holes, or if I just want to go out and throw a big bomb, like you just throw these things really far. Predators, very useful disc. Uh, great for the wind. Um, I got a Z Predator. Very, very stable. Um, this thing will not flip over. Um, you want consistency. Sacrifice some distance. Go with the Predator. Um, ESP Predator. This thing is really beat up. Flies very straight. Not natural like your Predators, but straight with a hard hyzer. But uh, still very consistent. Very dependable. Um, next. Oh, I lied, I got one more driver. Avenger SS, I use these for rollers. Um, both of them, ESP, Z, they both fly about the same. Um, just great rollers out of the box. All right, mid-ranges. I just picked up a Stalker about a month ago. Really like it, it's like, um, a longer flying buzz, basically is the best way to describe it. You need to go a little further than a buzz, but don't want to go too far. If you want to kind of throw a driver, but you want to throw a mid-range, perfect disc, stalker. Got a meteor, easy turnover disc, fast turnover disc. Most turnover discs aren't, that are mid-ranges aren't that fast. This is a fast flippy disc, so it's kind of nice if you have to throw 350 foot, 360 foot Anheuser. That just never comes out. The Z drone. These are the world's edition. I just got a blank stamp on. So um, stable, mid range, super stable. It's gonna go left. My buzzes, which are my babies. And I would actually, if I could, I'd have five buzzes in my bag. I just don't really need that many, but I like them so much. But uh, they're all Z buzzes. They're just all beat in differently. This is a newer run. Stable straight flippy i mean they're most consistent mid-range in my opinion if you don't throw a buzz and you haven't tried one out i would definitely suggest trying out a buzz um, great for any mid-range shot um, woods no woods just the most consistent mid-range disc i've ever thrown two different types of putters this one i do not putt with it's a zone um, I use it for up shots and I use it a lot for flick up shots, sidearm up shots also known as. It's very stable for a putter so it's great for if you need a stable shot and you can throw it hard it won't go really more than 250 feet, 280 feet. My putters I putt with are Pro D Challengers. Um, I have two in my bag. This one I putt with um, for most distances and this is my flippy one. Um, it's not really that flippy but for a challenger it's flippy. Um, challengers are kind of a consistently hyzer. They, they're uh, consistently stable butter. Um, you know it's not going to flip over on you. Um, so it's pretty easy. I think they're really easy to putt with, uh, in my opinion. They have a, a good amount of glide, not as much as a magnet per se, but they're uh, very consistent putters. 